Uh, can't believe we're here. Ugh. It, hey, I'm not. I'm just as surprised as you are that you wanted to do this. Look, all right, it's not something I wanted to do, but it's something I have to do. All right, Scarlet has been really persistent about wanting to meet my dad, and as much as I really, really, really don't want her to. How does she not know how much of your psychopath of your father is? She said she started to play the games. How does she not put two and two together? I don't know, man. She's a little different, for sure. It's what I like about her. She sees the good in you, and I hope, I'm guessing she can probably see the good in your It'd father. Be a really, really long stretch to see that good, but sure. But look, I just need you to make sure I don't explode on him. Because you remember the phone calls we had recently? They have not been good, so... Yeah, and especially don't need you reaching for the knife like last yeah, time. So I need to try and stay calm, cool, and collected, have a actual nice conversation with my dad, and convince him that we, me and him need to act like a normal family for whenever I bring Scarlet here. All right. So try uh, to keep me in line, and I will try to keep myself in line. All right. Yeah, your siblings are going to be here to help mediate as well. No. So, uh, going into the trenches. I don't think they're here. Um, I haven't seen, like, Lizzie and Evan. No. I haven't spoken to them in a while. Dad? William? William? Oh, oh God. I suppose it's good to see you. Yes, it's good to see you, too. How you been? I've been fine. How about yourself? Uh, better? So Definitely better. So far? So you're still hanging out with Freddy? Yep. He's... I've traded one sibling for the other. Is this going to be a thing now? You're just going to latch on to whichever of my children you can find and plague me forever? It's not that they, I've attached myself to them. It's that they have attached themselves to me. Your son literally had nowhere else to go and had to move in with me. That does sound like my son. Sorry. Oh, come in. Make yourself at home. Uh, yep. What do you need? Sorry, yep, sorry, for the slight roast. Um, sorry for the slight roast. I don't, I don't need uh, much fr from you, to be honest. Just, uh, you know, a nice conversation between a, you know, a father and a son. A normal, normal convo. Do you need money or something? I don't need money. Actually, he could use money. No, I don't. I have a job now. I have two jobs. Yes, and you still struggle to pay rent. I don't know what you're paying for on the site that you can't afford rent with two jobs. Uh... <sighs> Look, Have I- Have you seriously created a household where Freddy is the more responsible? Uh, of the three. That is even more impressive. Of the four. That is even more depressing. What is it that you need? I- Okay, well, it's not really me that needs something. Um, I have a girlfriend, in case you didn't know. And? Did you expect me to not know? Well, wait, wait, you knew? Yeah, I, have, I haven't told you. Yes, yes, I knew. Oh my god. William, are you hacking our security system again? Are you hacking into my cameras no. again? No. Are you hacking my phones or his phone? No. Are you hacking the Pizzaplex? No. Why would that ma Why would the Pizzaplex matter? I'm pretty sure he would hack it if he wanted to. Look, regardless, how the heck did you figure this out? I was notified by Facebook. Damn it. Wait, you still use Facebook? Not everything is uh... high-tech information that I collect. Wait, you still use Facebook? Yeah, what? What's wrong? What? You don't use, like, Twitter or anything? No, stuff's so toxic. So is Facebook. Yeah, but Facebook's a little easier because you actually know the people that are being toxic. At least it's not as bad as YouTube. I yeah, don't even get me started. Yeah, yeah, I can't. Whoo, those comments. Something we can all agree on. <sighs> and just the drama. Hey, God, there's so yes. much drama. Uh, yeah, let's not even do all that. Look. Anyway, yes, you have a girlfriend now. Do you need my blessing for an engagement or something? What? Whoa, no. whoa, no, 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 no. Sorry, I expected you to have some sort of rash thing that you were going to propose here. Whoa, whoa. What else is it? Okay, I know I'm not like the most responsible person on the planet, but I do have some responsibility in me. It's hard to believe, but he, it... I would certainly hope so at this point. Anyway, I'll, he, his girlfriend wants to meet family, so to speak. Yes. Why? She wants to meet you. She wants to meet Circus Baby at some point. What, what What do you mean? Why? I don't know. She just wants to know she's a family. She's very family oriented. Be oriented okay. with her family then. Huh? I look, I know I can, but she's been really persistent about meeting you. And is she normal? Surprisingly, uh, yes. Yeah, I'd say she's actually decently normal. She's a mechanic. She's a car mechanic at an auto shop. She loves horror games, which terrifies me. And she actually tries to make sure he does the good things in life and takes care of himself and sleeps. Thanks. I mean, I'm saying all the positive things about her. <sighs> well, that does sound normal and beneficial indeed. Yes. So once again, why would you like to meet, well, me and potentially your animatronic stepsister? Um, well, that part I really don't know. I guess she just really wanted to know the family of the guy she's dating. I mean, she's been really interested in everything since she found out about Freddy. 
Oh yeah, that was another thing. She didn't know the existence of living, talking animatronics. And she's interested in this. Yeah, very much I so. you said she was normal. Well, like I said, is normal enough. Normal to our standard. Let's say, let's yeah. keep it. I would say that's probably the hmm. closest to normal we've had out yeah. of any person I know. Yeah. It's to be expected. Yeah. Well, if you must, fine. Bring her here. Introduce. Or I could come visit. Introduce. We'll get it over with. That's, okay. There needs to be an agreement. Yeah. I know me and you don't get along, which is why I'm trying to keep this civil. When she meets you and meets the family, can we try to keep it like we don't hate each other every other day? Why would we do that? He wants a good first impression. Exactly. So you want to create some sort of facade? Yeah, basically. You want to lie to her? You, no, um, no, no, no. At no. least for well, not lie. You know what? Maybe you know just, what? Maybe don't look at it like that. Maybe look at it as a way of like you two actually attempting to reconcile. Like if you guys can be, if you guys could pretend to like each other. Yeah, and, and like father son bonding and trying to forget the past and the trauma and all that other stuff that comes with it for like a half an hour. Then maybe you guys won't attempt to kill each other every time. Because I'm, I'm actually proud that you neither of you have reached for any type of weaponry. If I were to attempt to kill him, he would no longer be here. Huh? That's not helping. I'm just saying I have quite an excellent track record. William! Look, I, I, just, I just want this to go well. I really care about her. And she really cares about meeting you and everyone else. And I just want this to go well. It should not be entirely hard. It's not like I hate you anyway. <sighs> yeah. I just realized that you have many disappointing character traits about you. That don't line up with your philosophy. Yes, I know. See, we're doing great. Those are some of those comments that probably should not be brought up. Yeah. And what type of comments would you suggest? We engage in small talk. Talk about like... Talk about how the weather... Talk about the weather? Talk about positive things about your son. And I'm sure your son has some positive things to talk about you, right? Yeah, like how he took care of the family for years. Uh... I'm not entirely sure if he's saying took care of the family or, you know, took care of the family. We're gonna leave that ambiguously. Regar- just- Ambiguitously. Just- Oh dear, this household. Trying to keep things normal-ish, right? We don't have to act all chummy chummy like we're best friends, but- Sure. Try to get along. <clears throat> uh. Any examples? Any more examples? Oh, let's- Give us a prompt. Okay, okay, okay. She asks you, so, uh- how was it like raising Michael? Not as challenging as other things in my life. That's See? sort of positive. That It's like a 50-50. Still a little snarky, but positive enough. Okay, okay. Who uh, knows, maybe she'll think it's funny. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and then from Michael. So uh, what does your dad do then? <sighs> he supports the family and makes sure that we're all taken care of via his job. Which is? What if she asks for details? You need to be ready to answer these things. Ugh. <sighs> She could ask these at any moment, even if I'm not there to support you. I know. What are you going to say? Uh, 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 animatronics. And? and? <sighs> is he malfunctioning? He is actively trying to find positive things to say about you. I am soul searching. Oh, and let's not bring up any dead siblings as well, by the way. Yeah, I don't want her to know as about- literally, literally or figuratively? Like, literally. Well, she can meet the other two at some point. I don't think that's going to be a thing we should bring up at the dinner table. That is a good point. She already, Very well. She already knows about the animatronic sister, so... Yeah, Circus Baby is not a surprise. I think knowing that I have two siblings that are ghosts might be a bit more shocking. And how long have you been with this person? Oh, God. I don't even know now. A couple uh, of months? Three months, actually. And none of this has come up? Well, no. I mean, yes. I've just been kind of turning it you've down. Lied. No, I haven't lied. I've just been turning See, it down. You've omitted truths. No, I just to, I just didn't want her to know. You've denied to answer questions. To be, yes, that's sure. Sure. <sighs> if it helps, he has been trying to be more truthful to her since a lot of the a lot of the relationship started on lies. Like, oh, I don't know. Her, you telling her my house was your house? I mean, it's not a lie. And that I was your animatronic butler? Okay, well that was a lie. Mm -hmm. I also didn't know how she was going to react to the whole, you know, being alive thing, but she took it a lot better I than I thought. I can make your animatronic butler if you choose. I have staff bots I can bring to the house for that. Yes, but it would be entirely funnier if it was him. It would be a it. lot funnier if it was him. I won't, I won't, I won't, I promise, I promise. It was just a thought <sighs> for a minute. Yes, I totally don't have chips that could do that. Don't worry. I fear you sometimes. You should fear me all the time. Mm. Mm. Okay, so we're good for whenever this happens? Sure. Okay. Uh, you promise? I promise to 
go to the best of some of our abilities, the uh, goals of which we've set forth here. It's good enough for me. Yeah. Oh, I guess there's one question that she's probably going to ask. What? Where's your mother? Oh. Look, we don't talk about mom, okay? We don't talk about mom. We just don't talk about Sure. It. That's a fair enough answer. Just. Am I never going to find out about the mom? No. Do you want to talk about her? Yes! No. Then no, you're never going to find out about her. Darn it. Ugh. Oh, is Circus Baby here, by the way? Is she down in her lab with you? Why would I tell you that? I was going to ask you if you can tell her that her ice cream arrived a couple hours ago. Why would you say that hours later? Because it's funny if uh, if she feels like she forgot her ice cream outside. It would be all melted. It would ruin the entire stabilization process of ice cream. Kind of the point. Oh, whatever. <sighs> oh, you were making a joke. Yes, yes, I was. Yeah, it was pretty obvious. You'll do better next time. Ugh. <sighs> All right, well, thanks, Dad. I, I appreciate it. Of course. Best of luck. Thanks. Goodbye. Oh, by the way, your son has some crazy animatronics that are still roaming around that he may be after you. Hey, 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 shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Uh, shut up! Shouldn't you tell him? No! Whatever. What is wrong with you? I feel like you should know if the killer animatronics He's still not going to know about that, 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 that. No, no, no. We still haven't found Jeff. I know. It's okay. Maybe he'll die before the dinner happens. Who knows? Are you kidding? Michael! What? Okay, we'll tell him... After the dinner, after the dinner.